Hey, what's up, Boost family? It's Chip Flanagan here, and alongside with me, I got none other than Lefty Golfer. Oh, that's what she said. The goaltender here, heading on to the finals. How you doing there, uh, Lefty man? Doing great. How about yourself, man? Good, man. Good. It's uh, you know, I mean, it's it's the finals here of season number eleven. You know, we're closing down uh, NHL eleven. It's almost done. NHL twelve is about to come up. Uh, are, are are you almost glad that uh, NHL 11 is uh, done with, or did you want maybe a longer season here, man? No, I'm totally fine with it, ready to move on to the new game. I mean, really, if it wasn't for the moose, I would have traded in NHL 11 a long time. <laughs> hey, a lot, a lot of people say the same thing, man. Now, Lefty, uh, I mean, you're going to the finals here, you're the goaltender. I know you took a season off before, but uh, if I'm correct, man, this is your first time in the Moose Cup championship game here in the finals. Uh, I got to ask, man, I mean... Are you nervous, man? Any butterflies going in, man? First time in the finals. I mean, what what do you do, man? What do you do to get yourself ready for a big game like this, big series that's coming down to the Blue Minis, taking on that's what she said, two of the hottest teams here in season number 11. Uh, is, is there any worries coming in first time, man, as a goaltender in the finals? Actually, no. Um, all season long, you know, my team's been behind me, so there's no worries on that end. And then to get ready, all I do is take a nap so that way I can get up to work the next morning. <laughs> awesome, man. Awesome. Hey, I mean, I, I just talked to Valcor and stuff. He sounds real confident as well. I mean, it should be a great series. We should have it streamed live. I, I believe NJ Ski is going to be streaming it live there on Mercis. So check that out. And then, um, you know, I mean, for the finals, um, in season number 11, I mean, you guys dominated, man. I mean, 19-4-1 record. Uh, but is there anybody uh, this season that – Maybe gave you a, a tough tie, either a team or a player. Who's the hardest opponent this season for a lefty golfer, man? Hmm. Um, I don't know. There, there weren't too, too many games, actually, that uh, they, there were a lot of goals scored out. I mean, uh, there, I mean there's a couple of them. Uh, the, the one series that we did get swept was West Stank and Johns. Um, you know, they, they, they play, you know, a, a, a dirtier type of hockey. You know, they get in there, crash the net, dig for the bucks, and... You know, it's a goaltender. If my D's not there to grab those, it's just, it's hell on you. So, okay. um, I mean, but that was the toughest team, I'd say. I mean, yeah, I mean, Breath Second Jones, I mean, they, they did beat you guys in the regular season, but the come playoff time, you guys swept them, man. I mean, you know, they got guys like Jason Morsky, Hugh Laurie, you know. Uh, I mean, uh, is there anybody in particular that, you know, when you sign in, you're like, oh, shit, I got to face this guy tonight, you know what I mean? Anybody on that offense that gives you a hard time, you know what I mean? No, I not, not, not with the defense that I've, I've had this season. Okay. I mean, they, they adjust real well, and I mean, they go in and say, "Hey, we got to watch this guy, cover this guy." Um, and you know, it's, you know, with, with the team that we had, no, not really at all, actually. I mean, the first time we played the Blue Meanies during the season, um, we we actually did very real well against them. And I think I can't remember, but I might, I think I might have got shut out or only let one goal in a couple games there. I can't remember the scores exactly right here, but. I mean, they're good about shutting uh, key players down. Okay, okay. I mean, uh, the Blue Minis, I mean, they got tremendous offense. I mean, you're talking about Cam Iam, NJ Ski on their cool fumble. I mean, shutting those guys is big. I mean, uh, what about that team? I mean, is there anybody that you're worried on the opposition, on the forward line there? I mean, those three guys that I mentioned, you know, NJ Ski, Cam Iam, cool fumble, man. I mean, they, they definitely uh, pack a punch, man. But, I mean, you mentioned, you know, you got Valcor, you got Tucker Fan, tremendous defensemen. But also on the other side, I mean, on the other side's got Melo and Plunkies, which, you know, are not walk-bys either, man. So that's why I think on, in this series, I mean, we haven't had a – I don't think we had a big matchup like this in the MHL Finals, especially lately, man. A lot of teams, you know, lately in the MHL Finals either won it in four or five. But I think this series has potential maybe even going 0-7, going the distance here. Uh, what do you think, man? I, you know, I, I could see it, yeah. I, I hope not. I mean, I, I hope <laughs> it's possible. But, um, yeah, I, I could see it going, going the distance. So. Okay, okay. I mean, we're winding down. It's almost done here. Um, I, I don't know if you played the demo yet for NHL number 12 or read anything about it. Is there anything particular that you, uh, you know, or your thoughts on NHL 12, man? Which is going to be released a couple of days, man. Yeah, um, I mean, as a goaltender, the only thing I'm worried about is how the goaltender interference. I'm worried that there's going to be some sort of way that people can get away with that, and it's going to cause me problems, you know. Um, I don't know how, you know, 
playing the demo, I can't play as a goalie, or at least I don't know how. But uh, I, I'm really afraid that there's going to be something that people are going to be able to do, you know, knock me over, not get called for it, and then the goal is going to count and I'm going to get screwed. Um, but other than that, I'm looking forward to, forward to the game. Uh, that's definitely for sure. So. Awesome. I mean, you, you bring a great point, man. I mean, with the goalie, there's definitely going to be a lot more interactive with the goaltender this season for NHL 12. A lot of different options there, you know what I mean, screening, getting the guy out of that zone there. So uh, definitely something to look for. I mean, a great point there on goaltending. Uh, should be, you know, I think some guys are might change their game style, man. Goaltenders coming into NHL 12. It might be a lot different there. Uh, before I let you go here, uh, Lefty, any predictions on this series, man? I, I know some guys find it, you know, bad luck to do it or anything, but what do you think, man? Lefty go for first time here at MHO Finals. Is this the season for you guys taking this cup? Even for Valcor, a guy like Valcor, he's been in the finals. Uh, is this the season, man? Uh, I, I can't say exactly how many games, but I'm, I'm very confident in our team, and, you know, I'm definitely hoping that we can bring home the cup. So it'd be, it'd be a great way to end uh, season 11 and NHL 11. Yeah, so. be the last champs, you know, NHL 11 for the summer season. Hey, uh, Lefty, thanks for coming on on here. I just wanted to show the guys a preview, you know, what, what we're looking to do for next season for NHL 12. You know, we could do interviews right here, right on Skype, like I have it with Lefty Gopher, or right on the Xbox through either audio or both, you know, uh, as you guys saw with Valcor. I'm also going to have Kim I am, NJ Ski. And uh, it's something, you know, that we're trying to do, get more guys involved here in the league. Uh, but thanks again, man. Thanks for uh, coming on here, and uh, good luck in the finals, man. All right, thanks. Have a good one. Awesome. There you guys go. Lefty Golfer, Jim Flanagan here, signing out.